Hi, I'm Kirby Allison, and in today's video, I'm going to talk about our rep stripe ties that we feature here online at kirbyallison.com. Rep ties or diagonally striped ties are our cornerstone of American menswear and Ivy style. Very closely associated with the well-dressed here in the United States, these ties actually got their founding back in Britain in the 19th century. Rep ties were developed from the regiments. Each of the British regiments, which are different divisions within the British military, uh, each had their own colors that they would fly on their flags. This, whenever they were marching into battle, the flag or the uh, regiment's colors would be flown. That would help those uh, generals know where each regiment was on the battlefield. Now, British military culture is so closely associated uh, with the uniforms and what they were wearing that whenever the advent or the evolution of the classic necktie uh, came, it was only a matter of time before those regiments developed their own regimental or rep ties. Traditionally, uh, each regiment would have a rep tie uh, that echoed uh, the colors that would be found in that regiment's flag. You'll notice that the diagonal on a proper British rep tie is going from the left shoulder uh, to the right hip, signifying the saying from heart to sword, a British military saying. The rep tie evolved from just something that was associated with British military regiments uh, to uh, British uh, private schools uh, and other organizations all developing their own classic rep tie with various designs and colors. Now, when American Ivy culture began to develop in the early 20th century, they took inspiration from this, developing their own rep ties but to avoid directly copying the British, they changed the direction of that stripe going from the right shoulder to the left hip. Now you'll see all of the rep ties that we feature here online at Kirby Allison. All of our sovereign grade ties uh, are designed in this classic uh, British tradition of the diagonal originating from the left shoulder going down to the right hip. Now, you may ask yourself, is it possible to wear a rep tie if you don't belong to that particular regiment? Uh, the reality is, is outside of the United Kingdom, there are a few that will know which particular regiment a rep tie is associated with. Uh, so without the question, you can get away with that. We have a modest collection of rep ties here on KirbyAllison.com. And in today's video, I just wanted to show a few of my favorites to you. So the first three uh, ties that I have are amongst my most favorite. Uh, these are actually something I call our London Stripe Ties. This is a very a narrow stripe. It's a, a twill a silk, uh, and then this is a printed on top of that. Now, what I love about this is, again, the symmetric um, width of these various stripes going from the left shoulder to the right hip uh, is very formal and very classic. Uh, these uh, are as classic of a business tie as our London Dots or even uh, our Grenadines. And beautiful ties, and again, very easily worn. Uh, that's why we added them to our permanent collection uh, that you can find year-round here online at kirbyallison.com. Again, these three ties, we have a navy and uh, silver, we have a navy and red, uh, and then a burgundy and silver are classic ties. Uh, you could wear these uh, all year round and absolutely beautiful. So one of the things that I love about a good rep tie uh, is it's not seasonal. It's an all year round tie. It's classic and very easily worn. Uh, now, if you're looking for a little bit more uh, of a bold stripe, something that might have a little bit more visual interest, uh, we have these uh, two right here. What I like about this is the way that this is woven, you see two different textures. So these burgundy and these green stripes are a classic twill. Uh, and then there is a different texture, a slightly more square weave uh, here on the navy uh, that give uh, just a heightened visual contrast, not just in the color of the stripes, but the texture of the stripes. Again, uh, very easy to wear and absolutely beautiful ties. And in my opinion, uh, that additional visual textures uh, make these a little bit uh, even more formal than these London striped ties. And then finally, uh, one of my favorites, we have this in several different colorways, but I pulled uh, one of my personal favorites here for this video uh, is again, a bold, very wide stripe. Uh, you see that right here. Uh, this is silver and burgundy. And again, what I love about this tie uh, is it's bold, it's rich, uh, and it's uh, at the same time, a very classic. I mean, it's an elegant tie that you could hold on forever. 
So there we go, a few uh, reptiles. I thought I would share a little bit of the history of reptiles with you. Uh, and of course, all these ties and so much more can be found online at kirbyallison.com. If you enjoy the content that we film here on this channel, uh, the best way to really support us is to go visit kirbyallison.com. Uh, all of the products that we sell, we sell exclusively on the website. You can't find them on Amazon. So if you're looking to support uh, us and the content that we're filming, make sure you visit kirbyallison.com. Of course, I'm Kirby Allison, and I love to help the well-dressed acquire and care for their wardrobes while exploring the world of quality, craftsmanship, and tradition. Thanks for watching today's video.